Greetings, Flower Mound Church. It is good to be with you as always. A word today about live worship resuming from a little bit different perspective. As you can see behind me, this is the view that your worship team has had every Sunday since March. That's right, we have four cameras, multiple lights, three computers, an incredibly talented tech team behind us all making this happen. And how grateful we are that you as the body of Christ have been showing up every single Sunday so faithfully. It is obvious to me what your heart is about, that you have hearts that want to praise God, that you want to offer up thanksgiving for the many blessings in your life, and that you are people who want to pray for the concerns of the world and one another. And so thank you for continuing to be the body of Christ as we have been faithful, worshiping online each and every week. But it isn't just that that you have done to be the church. I believe throughout this time that we have figured out that the church is not the building. The church is the people. And though our building has been closed, our church never has because you all have shown what it means to live in the spirit as you have had Zoom online classes, as we have continued in missions, feeding what those who are hungry and the homeless, as you have been ones who have been so faithful in caring for one another through phone calls and sidewalk visits. Thank you for being the body of Christ. And I know we are all excited to get back to see one another in person. And though we know that worship, when we resume live scheduling, will be a little bit different, we had hoped that we would resume at the end of July. What I do need to tell you today is that our reopening team has been meeting on a regular basis and watching the numbers of not only Denton, Collin, Tarrant, and Dallas County, and have recognized that as those numbers have been rising over the past couple of weeks, it would be best to wait a little while to resume live worship. So our new target date for opening will be August the 16th. It is our hope that we will be able to have one service at 11 o'clock inside. And of course, there will be all kinds of protocols and procedures that we will need to do to make sure that we do not spread the virus in a large indoor setting. However, what I want to assure you of is as many of you have expressed to us in the survey and in conversations, there are a lot of people who won't be comfortable even coming back then. We want to honor that and make sure that you know, not only will our 11 o'clock, but also our 930 worship service remain online, as well as all of our Sunday school and small group options. This is because we are a church that wants to make sure nobody feels excluded, whether it's because um, you are nervous about contracting the virus or because you have somebody in your life who you are concerned about that you do not want to be a potential carrier. And so we want to honor that in a way of saying, we are here for you for the long haul. Online worship is a new ministry of Flower Mound United Methodist Church, and it will not be going away. And we will ensure as long as we need to that every single person who wants to participate in any of our studies or worship has the opportunity to do so online. And so with that, we know that the Spirit has been leading us as a body of Christ into understanding new ways to be the church. And what a beautiful gift of God it is that we have so many talented and faithful individuals who have been living out their calling through this. If you are somebody who wants to continue to get involved, whether it's in our live worship planning um, options of how we're putting those procedures and policies and volunteers together, or whether it's connecting with a new Sunday school class or being a part of our care team or our missions, just know that we are still the church, open for you and with you to continue to make disciples of Jesus Christ. And so... 
We will look forward to being back together in live worship, hopefully on August the 16th. But until then, please join us this Sunday for 9.30 and 11 o'clock online worship. See you then.